doing a little morning quiz. Team Bay. <laughs> Morning. It's early afternoon actually. They keep turning the clocks back by an hour each day. I'm getting a bit confused with the time. I was meant to be at a pamper party right now. <laughs> now last time I went to the pamper party, um, I spent a lot of money, so I wasn't sure whether to go anyway. But we just went to a talk by a guest speaker called Ricky Bastin about the Malaysian flight that went missing. What year was it? 2014. In 2014, and it was so. So interesting. Anyway, we can talk about it for ages. We sat on the balcony talking about it now. It was really, really good. Um, and he's doing a speech every day, isn't he? He's a guest speaker, so he's in the headliners. Every day he's doing a different plane situation. Yeah. Um, but yeah, that was brand on Special tomorrow. So it was really good. And yeah, the clock's going back, so it's now quarter past one. Forward, sorry, forward, not back. So it's now quarter past one ish. So just sat on the balcony having a drink and then we're going to get some lunch. And it's a formal night tonight, it's our first formal night. Yeah. Um, so we'll probably get ready a bit earlier. We've got the escape room booked at three o'clock. It was quite annoying actually because Brandon booked it the other day um, for one evening. And we got there and we're waiting and waiting and they turned up and we're like, oh you can't do it because there's not six people. Which is a bit annoying. So, um, no it doesn't, it doesn't say on the thing there has to be six people. And it doesn't say when you're booking how many people have already booked or like if it's unlikely you'll be able to do it because we booked it the same day didn't we so I would have expected yeah. someone to be like oh there's not enough people like don't bother fair, wasting your evening there about. so she said it was busier on sea days so she booked us in for today so we're doing that at three o'clock so that should take us to about half four half four five and then um, we had dinner booked at six we only managed to book a shared table today and there's a photographer and that out and the pianist and all that so there's loads going on so we thought we'll just get in the queue later and hopefully that's all right oh my god my head is so burnt Realise how strong the sun is out here. So I've had sun cream and everything on, and I'm just like a crisp. I'm like a crisp. My legs look really they do. You want to see Branna's legs? <laughs> Absolute golden goddess. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so we're just having a drink, and then um, we'll probably head for pizza. I think we're on pizza, aren't we? Because we haven't had pizza yet. Yeah, we're going to try the pizza yeah. slice. Just golden our legs up a little more. <laughs> We have just done the escape room. Well. <laughs> Half done the escape yeah. room. It broke. It broke when we, we were was, the first our time we've done it. We had a team of ten. Yeah. And it was too we was too good that we broke the system. <laughs> no, the system just didn't work and then he had us looking around for stuff, didn't he? And yeah. it turns out there was nothing to be looking think, for. It should think, have worked, he just I, didn't. I think he was hoping that um <laughs> it would work in that time. So he was just trying to Get, yeah. make it part of the experience to look for something um, but we'd and actually then, already um, done it and it wasn't going to the next part yeah. but it was good what we did and then we're all going back to the whole same group's going back tomorrow at three to finish yeah. it well lanyards playing it see first officer chloe technician brandon i should actually I finish it tomorrow though when it... it'll be worth money i think 20 yeah. quid's quite good for those yeah guys. 20 pounds each but the floor moves and everything it's quite good they do another one as well but apparently that's more family yeah, family stuff. We can get ready for dinner now. As I said, it's first full night. Woo! Right. Past start doing our walk around deck eight today though, and then um, the cabin. This is why we paid more to pick our cabin because there's some cabins there and they're on the deck. I'll try and get a little video and show you, but they're they're literally on the deck. So when you walk past, you're walking past someone's cabin, and some of them can search. You. I mean, how much money do these people pay for these cabins? It's crazy. So if you are going to book a balcony and spend that extra money then just spend a bit extra to pick your cabin because it'd be awful to be in one of them. Fair if you're upgraded, but otherwise, rabbit. Absolutely loving our cabin though. Says Brandon, right Brandon? <laughs> I love it, I left my pyjamas out today. The steward folded them for me. We have some free drinks again tonight, which is good. The latest forecast is in and shows that this evening and tomorrow the winds will drop a little more to around 12 to 15 knots and the seas will remain calm. I just want to make you also aware that from today you will see that our crew members will be wearing masks as they work around the ship. This is purely a preventative measure as we are heading back towards Europe with a long sea passage ahead of us and feel that it is prudent to ensure we all remain fit and well. 
As always, please do maintain all the usual hand washing procedures we are all so used to by now. Dress up in your formal suits and dresses. It is also an opportunity for us to thank you for sailing with us on our newest ship. Just like that our day's over another sea day gone now we've had a really long day actually it's been we've done loads we've done loads of loads we did um the pub quiz this morning before that we had breakfast in the restaurant which was mediocre today and then we did the quiz i'm ready <laughs> it's ready for dinner i did the talk by ricky bastin the flight guy as i'm calling him about the 737 max is right yeah boeing air flights that kept crashing just oh it's crazy they're really good talks so i'll probably go again tomorrow and then yeah we've just been chilling sitting on the balcony we had a cost of coffee in that and we've been to the infinity pool bar for sunset this evening which is lovely which is why we're a little bit late for dinner but we're gonna head to the keys aren't we and then we've got a show by the fortunes oh and we went to a quiz show didn't we like a game oh, show, game couples show, game yeah. show. They asked us to be in it, and I was like, yeah, yeah. Brown said no. I didn't say no. I'm sorry. It was funny to watch, though. It was really good to watch. And one of the ladies we met on the first day was taking part, and so it was really, really funny. Caroline. Oh, <laughs> Caroline, she cracks me up. <laughs> She's funny, and we saw a couple we went to dinner with the other night. So, yeah, it's been a good day, isn't it? Busy. I haven't filmed much, sorry. Um, but I'll take you to the Keys for dinner. <laughs> I couldn't decide what to get, so I've gone for both the katsu curry and the Malaysian pork. Brandon's got fish and chips. Lovely, lovely sunset. We've come back slightly early tonight, so we're going to watch a film, and there's loads of films and TV series and all sorts on the telly. It's really good. And it's a huge telly, isn't it, compared to the other ships we've been on? Yeah, it's a lot bigger. Good morning. We're at the Keys today. I've got salmon in my scrambled egg. Going to grab some fruit. I can put you in. I've been a throw up the sex in a uh -huh. And I can put you in I can put you in I can see the whole city from this balcony Just cracked open the wine we got at the airport Let's get a corkscrew though So we ordered some room service at the same time this was four ninety five, four seventy five, and Brandon got the roast beef, which was one fifty. After breakfast today, we went to the talk by Ricky Bastin, the flight guy, and he talked about the Air France flight four four seven, which was really interesting. And then we went for a swim. Well, I went for a swim. Brandon chilled in the sky dome. It was a bit quieter in there um, than the other areas. 
and then they put the greatest showman on didn't they so we watched a bit of that and then we were going to go and have a drink at one of the bars at the back of the ship they're just so busy like if you want to sit outside you have to set up shop at like 7 a.m to get a good seat so we decided just to come back onto the balcony and then crack open the wine but we didn't have a corkscrew so we all ended up ordering room service but quite happy here loving the little setup and we got harry lineker again tonight the singer ready for the evening we're going to watch harry lineker um, and then hoping to get into the glass house i'll probably have a drink before that at the sunset bar it's so nice outside i'll show you gorgeous right let's go We're just at the glass house. This one is supplemented. All the prices are on the menu. I haven't actually eaten here before, so I'm quite excited. What we got? We've got Korean sticky chicken lollipops. We've got tuna poke. Uh, up here. I think everything's matched with wine in that. Get some wine. Bigger plates, beef, chicken, pork, seafood. Drinks there. Oh, that really nice. We have gone with the octopus, Korean lollipops and pork belly with treats to start and then we're gonna share the main part. This is so good. It's in my beach, say she had bad. Anytime I knock, I knock it out. Rubber band, no rubber band. Thank you. Oh, I Thank you. So on your platter, madam, we have the Cajun Spice Fry. Mm -hmm. This is everything is edible on there. It comes along with the maize meal. This one is a lobster macaroni and cheese with some fire food from top. Yeah. Tiger prawns with the mango and avocado salsa and the green with the On your side, you have the tandoori chicken with the lentil. Yep. That's the cornbread chicken with the jello fries and some vegetables. Okay. This one is a southern. Is it good? Yeah. Yeah. It's in my beach, say she had bad. Anytime I knock, I knock it out. No rubber band, no rubber band. Every time I put down, they show me that. If I know too loud, she got my back. I do you go, I'm happy that. I do you go. Say everything I do is for my woman. Anything I talk, where you talk, I go do one. Me, I know they see another girl for my fish rocks. Loving you, loving you, now in my Brandon's birthday today, so I've gone to the buffet. So asleep. I've gone to the buffet and I've got loads of bits and bobs for him to have breakfast in bed. So I'm just gonna wake him up. Sweet, sweet semen. I know what they like, so I just keep cheesing. Hard drive full of heat seek. He's awake now, so I can talk normally. We're just watching Mr. and Mrs. Smith. Trying to come the same day as Jack rethink. You don't need Givenchy, you need Jesus. We're at Ripples and we're gonna get the Arshin tea. Why do y'all keep on me? I need reasons. Uh, I got plex in the mail peak season. Shout out to my UPS workers, making sure I receive it. I don't know how I got this mucky, but this might be a good time to end this video. See you in the next part, guys.